So we have a question from either Akamerer, or also known as Merer, or AKA Merer, not sure. Anyway, the, the question is, tell us the story of the craziest fan you've ever met. I don't know if this is the craziest fan we've ever met, but this is a memorable story. We met this person, a very intriguing individual who went by the name simply The Whistler. <laughs> and I was given a bit of backstory, I think by Jim. Jim said, there's this guy outside the bus goes by the name the whistler he's apparently like this unbelievable whistler well i saw his lips and they looked like good whistling lips well, they and were he said, like, yeah he you know, said he was like a championship whistler like he'd won a bunch of whistling competitions and stuff and he had also made us some art you know that kind of art that people sand make art. sand art but also the spray painting stuff right he had made sand art in glass and he made the kind of art where you put different size cans and use spray paint and you make these like lunar, like sunscape, yeah, yeah, yeah. crazy shit. It's like back of 70s van art. Yes, kind of, right? totally. Yeah. So anyway, we let the whistler come on the bus because we were all excited to hear his whistling. I thought he was gonna do like uh, Donna Lee whistling or some Charlie Parker thing, you know, it would blow our minds. So the um, whistler comes on the bus, he kind of looks like crazy West Coast hippie guy. Really long hair tied in, you know, multiple hair ties in a long ponytail. He's got a big beard and his lips are impressively moist. So... <laughs> and, a, and a constant pucker too. It's hard. It's like yeah. if you put your lip, kissed a, 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 a piece of glass and looked on the other side, that's what his lips looked. Yeah. They're just like... It looked like they were pre-pressed to glass. <laughs> he looked like he was capable of remarkable things so we were all <laughs> excited everyone was like there was this nervous anticipation like we are about to see some shit that we didn't know existed prior to now and the whistler is about to throw down and he does this and he gets his lips even more moist than they already were and while scanning the various members on the bus starts to do this <laughs> <laughs> but probably not that well. Becomes beginning. apparent the Whistler is a fucking crazy person. <laughs> and he's now on our bus giving us his sand art and spray paint pictures and whistling the Andy Griffith theme and probably about to murder us. So that's a story that comes to mind. Probably not the craziest fan we've ever met but right up there. A normal fan that Jim meets on a regular basis. <laughs> yeah. I'm a magnet. I'm a magnet. Freak magnet. I, enjoy, I enjoy my people. 